Aircraft carriers are the backbone of the U.S. Navy, acting as mobile airbases capable of launching powerful aircraft anywhere in the world. These massive warships have evolved significantly over the decades, incorporating cutting-edge technology, enhanced firepower, and improved efficiency. Today, we will explore five of the most iconic aircraft carriers ever built. Each one represents a different era of naval engineering and showcases how these floating fortresses continue to dominate the seas. Commissioned in 1975, the USS Nimitz was a groundbreaking warship, setting the standard for future aircraft carriers. It was one of the first to be powered by two nuclear reactors, giving it the ability to remain at sea for over 20 years without refueling. This nuclear propulsion system allowed it to travel at speeds exceeding 30 knots, making it one of the fastest warships of its size. At 1,092 feet long, it can accommodate more than 60 aircraft, including F-A-18 Hornets, E-A-18G Growlers, and E-2 Hawkeyes. Its deck is equipped with four steam catapults, allowing aircraft to take off in just a few seconds. The ship houses more than 5,000 crew members, including sailors, pilots, and maintenance personnel. It is also equipped with advanced radar and defense systems, including the Phalanx CIWS, Sea Sparrow missiles, and electronic warfare countermeasures. Over the years, the Nimitz has undergone multiple upgrades, improving its survivability and overall efficiency. Even after nearly 50 years in service, it remains one of the most powerful warships on the planet. Inside, the USS Nimitz functions like a small city. It has a vast internal infrastructure that includes a hospital with surgical facilities, a post office, multiple gyms, and even a dedicated television network for the crew. Living on an aircraft carrier for months at a time requires organization and discipline, and the Nimitz has developed a system that keeps thousands of sailors working efficiently around the clock. Entering service in 1977, the USS Dwight D. Eisenhower is one of the most frequently deployed aircraft carriers in U.S. history. It shares many of the same design features as the Nimitz, but improvements were made to internal systems, flight deck operations, and overall survivability. This carrier is capable of launching and recovering aircraft faster than its predecessors, increasing operational efficiency. Like all nuclear-powered carriers, it does not require traditional fuel, reducing logistical dependency. Its flight deck spans over 4.5 acres, large enough to launch and recover dozens of aircraft at once. It carries an advanced missile defense system including the RIM-162 Evolved Sea Sparrow missile, which protects against incoming threats. The carrier's self-defense systems also include the Phalanx Close-In Weapon System, which can fire 4,500 rounds per minute to intercept missiles and aircraft. The ship's electronic warfare capabilities allow it to jam enemy radar and communication systems, making it harder to detect in combat. The Eisenhower's onboard facilities are designed to keep the crew of over 5,000 sailors comfortable during long deployments. It has multiple cafeterias, recreational areas, and training spaces to ensure peak performance. With continuous upgrades and modifications, the Eisenhower remains a key asset in modern naval warfare. Commissioned in 1982, the USS Carl Vinson is known for its impressive operational record and ability to sustain long-term deployments. Measuring over 1,092 feet in length and weighing more than 100,000 tons, it carries an air wing capable of conducting both combat and humanitarian missions. Its hangar deck is spacious enough to accommodate various types of aircraft, including fighter jets, early warning aircraft, and refueling tankers. The Carl Vinson's firepower includes multiple defensive missile systems, advanced jamming technology, and countermeasures to prevent electronic warfare attacks. It has a vast internal infrastructure, including a medical facility with an intensive care unit, dental offices, and even a post office. The ship is essentially a floating city 
capable of remaining at sea for months without requiring resupply. One of the most famous moments in modern naval history took place aboard the Carl Vinson when it was used for the burial at sea of Osama bin Laden in 2011. This moment solidified its place in military history, demonstrating its capability for global operations at a moment's notice. Constant upgrades and modernizations have kept the Carl Vinson at the forefront of carrier operations. Commissioned in 1989, the USS Abraham Lincoln is one of the most modernized Nimitz-class carriers. It was the first of its class to undergo a midlife refueling and complex overhaul, which extended its operational life by several decades. This process involved upgrading its nuclear reactors, installing new communication systems, and improving its flight deck capabilities. With a full load displacement of over 100,000 tons, this carrier can operate in any ocean worldwide. It has a range of defensive and offensive weapons, including rolling airframe missiles and anti-aircraft guns. Its deck crew manages high-intensity flight operations daily, ensuring that aircraft can launch and recover under any conditions. The ship also has one of the most advanced command and control systems, allowing it to coordinate naval and air operations across vast distances. The USS Abraham Lincoln also played a role in disaster relief, providing humanitarian assistance during natural disasters. Its ability to generate fresh water from seawater and provide medical care makes it an invaluable asset beyond combat operations. The ship's ability to adapt and upgrade ensures its place as a major force in the U.S. Navy. Commissioned in 2017, the USS Gerald R. Ford represents the next generation of aircraft carriers. As the first in its class, it introduces numerous technological advancements, making it the most advanced warship ever built. One of the most notable innovations is the electromagnetic aircraft launch system which replaces traditional steam catapults. This system allows for smoother, more efficient aircraft launches, reducing maintenance and increasing sortie rates. The ship also features the advanced arresting gear, which improves the recovery of landing aircraft. With more automated systems on board, the carrier requires fewer crew members than previous generations, lowering operational costs. It is equipped with state-of-the-art radar and sensor systems, improving situational awareness and defense capabilities. The USS Gerald R. Ford has increased electrical power output, allowing it to integrate future energy-based weapons, such as laser defense systems. Costing over $13 billion to build, it is the most expensive aircraft carrier in history, but its technological advancements set the foundation for future naval dominance. The ship has a redesigned flight deck that allows for more efficient aircraft movement, increasing operational effectiveness. With a reduced crew size and increased automation, it represents the future of carrier design, ensuring that the U.S. Navy remains the dominant naval force for decades to come. These aircraft carriers represent the evolution of U.S. naval power, from the pioneering USS Nimitz to the cutting-edge USS Gerald R. Ford. Each one has contributed to the Navy's ability to project force across the globe, ensuring air superiority and maritime security. As technology advances, future carriers will continue to push the boundaries of naval engineering, making them even more powerful and efficient. The United States remains the leader in aircraft carrier technology with these warships serving as a testament to decades of innovation and strategic dominance.